Hello and welcome to Video Jog. We're going to show you how to make crispy risotto cake and seafood ragu. You will need the following ingredients to serve four people. 16 shrimps peeled with the head on. 400 grams of fresh clams. 150 grams of calamari rings. Three cloves of garlic sliced. 200 grams of cherry tomatoes. Half a courgette cut lengthways. Two tablespoons of basil, roughly chopped. Two tablespoons of parsley, roughly chopped. 60 mils of white wine. Four tablespoons of olive oil. 30 grams of butter. Half a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. Half a tablespoon of tomato puree and salt and pepper. And for the risotto, 250 grams of short grain rice, 500 milliliters of water, one teaspoon of saffron, a quarter teaspoon of cayenne pepper, three tablespoons of grated parmesan, 50 grams of flour, and 60 mils of vegetable oil. Here is a summary of all the ingredients in a handy list. You will also need the following utensils. A saucepan with lid, a frying pan, a deep frying pan, a wooden spoon, a spoon, a spatula, a ring 6 to 8 centimetres in diameter, a tray and a small bowl of water. Step 1. Make the risotto. Add the rice to the saucepan and pour in the water. Add the saffron and the cayenne pepper and season with salt. Stir the ingredients and bring the water to the boil. Once the water is boiling, Turn down the heat so that the water is simmering. Place the lid over the pan and simmer for 10 to 15 minutes or until the rice has a creamy consistency. When the rice is creamy, add the parmesan cheese and stir in. Now remove from the heat and leave to cool for 10 minutes. Step 2. Make the risotto cakes. Dip the metal ring in the water and then place it onto a tray. Spoon some risotto into the ring. Gently push the rice down with the spoon so the rice is two to three centimeters deep. Now carefully lift off the ring so that you are left with the risotto cake. Continue making the cakes using up all the risotto. Now take each cake and place it into the flour. Turn the cake so that all the sides are covered in flour and shake off any excess. Step 3. Fry the risotto cakes. Put the frying pan on to a medium to high heat. Pour in the vegetable oil and allow to heat up. Place the cakes into the frying pan and cook for three to five minutes or until crispy brown. Turn the cakes over and cook again for three to five minutes. Remove from the frying pan and place onto a tray. Step four, make the seafood ragu. Place the saucepan onto a medium to hot heat and pour in the olive oil. Leave to heat up and then pour in the clams. Cook for one minute and let the clams start to open. Now add the calamari. Stir in and cook for one minute. Now add the shrimps into the saucepan. Mix in gently and cook for 30 seconds. Now add the garlic, 
the courgette and the tomatoes. Gently mix together and cook for one minute. Now add the tomato puree and season with salt and pepper. Add the half teaspoon of cayenne pepper and mix in gently. Pour in the white wine. Add the butter. Now stir in. And cook for two minutes. Remove the ragout from the heat. And finally, pour in the basil and the parsley and mix in. Step 5. Serve the dish. Place a risotto cake onto a plate. Spoon some of the seafood ragout onto the cake and to the side. Add a little of the juice and use to decorate the plate. And there you have crispy risotto cake and seafood ragout. Made the video jug way.